in this video you will see how to insert tally marks in word there are two methods to insert tally marks one is the text method and other is the draw method the draw method tally marks you can hold and place it anywhere inside the document let's get started look at your keyboard and you need to type this symbol the pipe symbol a small vertical line so to type this vertical line you need to press and hold the shift button on your keyboard and then click on the pipe button now repeat this process four times so one two three four okay now to add a line through these pipes select everything to highlight and then click on this abc button so this is a strike through option after clicking on it you will get the tally mark now if you want to draw a large tally mark that can be placed anywhere then click on the insert tab go to the shapes option and select the line press and hold shift button on your keyboard and then draw a line so the line will be a straight line now right click on the line go to the format shapes option select the color black and width for example 8 points now click on the line and press ctrl d to create multiple copies of line so you have to make 1 2 3 4 5 copies and now arrange them one after other after aligning all the lines click on the last line and you will see here the green dot you just have to click and hold the green dot and then move to create a line passing through the other four lines now this is not grouped so you need to press and hold the shift button click on each line to select all the lines and after selecting right click go to the groups option and select the option group so now all the lines are grouped together now you can just click on the grouped line and move them anywhere however notice that if you click on one of the line it will be selected and it will detach from the group so to avoid this just click on the group tally marks copy it and paste it as a picture so if you paste it as a picture you won't be able to move but to move it you can go to the wrap text and select in front of text now you can move this image freely and also resize it according to your need you can also rotate it if needed now check out this video that will show you how to insert tally marks in powerpoint Click on that like button, comment below and let me know if this video solved to your problem. And don't forget to check out these useful videos related to Microsoft Word. See you again in the next one.